in the trial. Why don't you explain the crime you have been accused There's of? There's no need for a trial! Protecting a demon is a clear violation. We can deal with this on our own. We shall execute them both. In that case, I'll decapitate them with style. I'll show you the most dramatic spray of blood ever. It'll be a spectacle. Luigi! You really kill a child as adorable as him? Such a thought fills my heart with sorrow. Alas, to see such a pitiful creature as this, I grieve for him. Perhaps it would have been better had he not been born at all. Those clouds. What do you call them when they're shaped like that? I can't remember. Wait. Where's Nezuko? Hey. The Hashira are speaking. What are you looking at? Your eyes should be over there. These are the nine highest ranking swordsmen in the Demon Slayer Corps. Those are the Hashira? <laughs> hey! Nezuko! Where did you take her? Nezuko! Zenitsu! He knows get! Murata! Never mind this, boy. What will we do with Tomioka? Seeing him standing there without any restraints is making me feel ill. Based on what Kocho told us, he's just as guilty of breaking the Corps' rules. How should we make him take responsibility? What kind of lesson shall we teach him? Igoro, you're as sharp-tongued as ever, I see. I love that side of you. Look at Tomioka over there, all alone and stoic-like. What a cutie! Oh, I think it's fine. He did come here without resisting. Let's come up with a penalty later. What I'm more interested in is hearing this boy's story. He's in this situation because of me. Tanjiro Kamado, as a fellow demon slayer, for what purpose are you traveling with a demon? You can take your time. Just answer the question. She's my... my young... <coughs> You look like you need some water. I can tell you've injured your jaw, so please, drink slowly. I added an anesthetic to the water to help. Your wounds are still healing, so it would be best if you didn't push yourself. Are you ready to tell us your story now, Tanjiro? That demon is my little sister. My family was attacked by a demon while I was gone, and I lost them all. Except for her. She may be a demon, but she's never hurt anyone. She never has, and she never will. She'll never harm a human being no matter what. Enough. Spare us the absurd ramblings. Anyone would defend their family. Why should I believe a single word you say? Sorry, but I'm not buying it. Please, just listen to me. I became a swordsman in hopes of finding her a cure. It has been two whole years since Nezuko became a demon. And she hasn't ever eaten anyone! Your storytelling is lacking any vibrant sparks of color. She hasn't eaten anyone, and she never will. If you're gonna plead your case, at least make it interesting to listen to. Excuse me? Something about this concerns me. I find it hard to believe the Master would have been unaware of this situation. think we should act without his permission. Maybe it's best if we wait until he arrives. My sister. Let my sister stay by my side. She can fight to protect humans as a demon slayer. I know she can. So please. Well, well, well. What exactly do we have brewing over here? Is that the moron who's been traveling with a demon? Start 
start talking. The hell are you trying to pull here? Oh, those new scars make Kimizugaro look even more handsome. Go on. Say that again, kid. She can fight to protect humans as a demon slayer. Isn't that what you said? You know what we call that? Being completely out of your mind, you idiot! Anyone who harms my sister answers to me! I don't give a damn if you're one of the Hashira! <laughs> Is that supposed to scare me? Cease this at once. The Master will be here at any moment. The Master of the Mansion has returned. My beloved children, I thank you for coming here this day. Good morning to you all. The weather is strikingly nice today. Perhaps with a blue sky, finding ourselves here at our semi-annual gathering with all the same faces. It brings me joy. He looks wounded. No, sick maybe? Is he really their master? 